We have new details now on one of Southern New England's favorite fall traditions. It had to be cut a few hours short today this year because of today's wet weather. Eyewitness News reporter Sheena Lasciuto has the story that's new at six. Well, today wrapped up Situate Art Festival's 51st year. Vendors from all across the nation come together to help raise money for local organizations. This year, however, came with some hard decisions. Umbrellas, a popular item at day three of the Situate Art Festival. It's been difficult. The risk of a downpour causing organizers to make the decision to close three hours early. Tents get weighed down. If the winds pick up, tents could get blown over and we have to worry about pedestrians getting hurt and so forth. But many vendors selling things like antiques and handmade items chose to play it safe. On Monday, only about 50 out of 200 set up shop. So this is really a downsized show quite a bit today, which is disappointing. A hard decision for small businesses that do well at this annual event, but one that's easier than losing hours of hard work. We have a lot of people with very expensive paintings, for instance, that they really can't pack into their cars when it's pouring out without ruining the merchandise. So. Many locals were ready to shop and help the cause. However, no live performances were allowed today as a safety precaution. Organizers told me people were still able to enjoy the last day of the festival, but the priority is to keep everyone and everything safe. I'm Sheena Lashuto, Eyewitness News.